Scorpio, welcome to your reading for the week of May 16th. Uh, let's see here. It's going to be a very mental week for you. You have the uh, two of clubs coming up first, which is you you and yourself is what the two of clubs represents. Uh, it's kind of like you talking to yourself, making some decisions. I want to say you have a couple cards here that I think came up last week so uh, or maybe the week before. Um, some very similar stuff, but this is you like talking to yourself, making some decisions, checking in with yourself, um, even doing things like looking at your health and, and being like, am I healthy? Am I doing what I want to do to be healthy? Like all these things, I mean... I literally think you're probably going to be thinking like a million things this week, really. Um, you know, you have several cards about several different things, all about thinking. Uh, so, you know, a lot of you could just be looking at your life and how you can overhaul your life this week or, or plan those things out at least. Um, how you can make some real decisions. Water signs seem really like fired up right now. So, you know, you could be like, you know, aggressively going after these things. But this could also be you um, talking to somebody else about starting a business as well. So... A lot of you could be planning things like that. Next, you have the five of clubs, thinking about your health, planning your health. Fives usually have to do with health in a lot of ways. So, And the five of clubs under some card reading systems is called renovating. So, you know, and it's not renovating like as in renovating your house. It's like renovating your body, renovating, you know, what you're doing and things like that. So a lot of you could be making those decisions. Um And uh, uh this could also be you. Like, There's this element of... um you know, being almost like dissatisfied with where you're at in general. So I, again, I think this is for all water signs, not just Scorpio, but it's definitely coming in for you. It's weird. That's kind of like a weird message. It's not like dissatisfaction. It's just like you're almost like just sick of where you are, but you're not. It's like you're not being critical of yourself, but, you know, you're just wanting something more, I guess, or something different. So a lot of you, I think, are, are, are kind of like jumping forward and just making some things happen. Again, that fiery type energy where you're just like kind of sick of it. But, but again, it doesn't feel that negative. So I don't, I really, I, I don't know. Maybe I don't know, but it feels like you're making those improvements. Um, next, you have the Ace of Diamonds. Uh, stepping forward on a new path. I think I could have probably delivered this to you in about 20 seconds this week because, I mean, it's, the message is very clear, very simple. It's like you stepping out on a new, very nice path. Ace of Diamonds is all about new beginnings, but very nice new beginnings. Also a very entrepreneurial energy. You have some very good entrepreneurial cards here as well. So a lot of you could be starting businesses, thinking about earning money from like maybe some of your talents, some things that you do, um, and, and looking at how you could do that. I would say by yourself. You know, we don't need gatekeepers anymore. I mean, look at how many people get famous on YouTube. Look at how many people get famous on Instagram. And look at how many people get famous on Snapchat or whatever. It's like, you know, there's no longer anybody standing in your way to, uh, you know, becoming famous or or starting your own business or, or whatever you know these things are becoming more open to us so i think that a lot of you could be like looking at how you can make money from your talents like i said and all these other things with this card um next you have the four of clubs uh, planning planning all these things out like i said um it, it's a very straightforward message this week can't say that enough um this is about being very balanced and balancing things out so it looks like you'll be at least approaching these things very mentally balanced. It's like you'll have a good idea of what it's gonna, things are gonna require for you to do this week, and uh, that is a good thing. And finally, you have the Jack of Diamonds. Uh, some of you could have an admirer at work, uh, so just know that. But this is also a card of working really hard, putting in a lot of work, but also being at the very beginnings of work as well. So it does feel like you're at the very beginning of something. Um, you know, something very good, I would say, something very interesting, and something you're probably going to be doing yourself in a lot of ways. Um, I would say maybe a very small percentage of you could have a partner. Again, two of clubs is usually you and yourself, like I said, but sometimes it could be a partner. But again, very, very small percentage of you. So very interesting week, very hardworking week, and also just a thoughtful week as well, but very interesting. So thank you for watching, and enjoy the week.